Hey girls and guys, it's Presley, and today in this video, I'm going to be talking about staying up to date with technology. Now, don't get me wrong, I am not, I swear I am not that old. I'm like almost 20 years old, and when, I, when I'm talking about staying up to date with technology, I'm talking about new phones. Because the phone I have right now is an iPhone 8. And it still has that little button in the in the um, in the lower center of the phone, and it it's a lot of my family members have these new phones, or like iPhone 12, 11, iPhone X, or even the new 13 that just came out recently, and it doesn't have the little button in the center. I know it's a little small thing to rant about, but I can't help myself by you know mentioning this, like. There's like so many people with these new phones and I feel like I'm the only one that hasn't caught up with everybody, but I'm not the only one. The only people I know that hasn't upgraded their phones to new phones is me, my grandma, my dad's mom, and my dad. So I guess we're the three majority of my family who just doesn't upgrade their phones. But me, I, I've had my iPhone 8 for about Hmm. Three years? Almost? I got it in 2019 for Christmas. So I guess I've had it for almost three years. And um I've 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 gotten used to it. I mean I know it's it's bigger, it's got the small little home button in the center, but now everybody's got these new bigger phones with no buttons. No, no buttons at all. I remember my grandma, my mom's mom, she asked me to help help her with something on her phone that she couldn't figure out. And I tried helping her and I didn't, I didn't even know how the phone worked because she got a new phone. And I, and I was thinking to myself, how the hell do you work this damn thing? And I even um, looked up a YouTube tutorial on how to, um, operate the new phones. I know it may, it may seem like I sound like an old lady, but trust me, I'm not. I swear. Because back in my day, now I really sound old when I say this. Back in my day, in the early 2000s, technology was still a thing, but it was super slow. And I didn't get my first phone until I was like 13 or 14. And I got the new, and I got the quote unquote new iPhone 5S. And it was, it was small, but it was my first phone. And another thing about phones, to be honest, I remember when I went to the gym, they had this little section where parents can drop off their kids into this little room where kids can be just watched over. And my mom and I went over there to watch some kids and this kid came in with a phone. He was like seven years old and I'm thinking, why in the hell are, they, are, are the parents giving these kids phones? I don't think young kids such as seven-year-olds or eight-year-olds should be having phones yet. It's my personal opinion. Everybody can do whatever they want with their kids, but if it's my, it's my personal opinion. And I already know I'm not going to be having kids. So if my two brothers end up having kids, I'm going to advise them to not give them phones, to not give their kids phones if they have kids. Because younger kids would have a big, like a, low attention span they always be on their phones and barely go outside because when I, I mean when I was a kid before I even got a phone I did stay inside but there have been times where I've been outside when I was a kid jumping on a trampoline and doing a bunch of crazy stuff when I was a kid <sighs> I swear I'm not that old I'm almost turning 20 in about a month it's crazy how I'm almost turning 20 like it's insane. The time flies really quickly and we're updating technology way too fast, especially the iPhones. They need to slow the hell down when it comes to updating to new phones. By the time they make the iPhone 14, it's probably going to be in the next few months. But come on, I swear, I just got this phone a couple of years ago, iPhone 8. But I asked my mom to get me a new phone on my birthday and I might get the new 13. It'll take me a while to get used to because you know how much I hate change. But eventually I'll get used to it and um, I'll use it to record um, future videos and upload them and stuff because whenever I record videos, I use my phone. I don't have one of those 
high-tech fancy cameras that a lot of people use with high definition full quality HD and a bunch of cool shit with special effects or whatever because when it comes to me uploading things and having like a own little personal set I have my own desk I have a tripod that costs like what 20 bucks that I've had for a couple years and I have my own phone to record the videos it's simple but not that special as some people would put it some people have their own studio to record videos and with ex with hundreds of dollars of equipment hundreds of dollars of equipment i wouldn't have enough money to pay for all that shit because all i need is right in front of me and i'm a minimalist i keep things short and sweet keep things short and sweet with my tripod my phone and a bunch of little decoratives around my desk that's why I like to keep it that way. And some people, they're not minimalists. Some people aren't minimalists like me. They have a bunch of shit. Some people hoard a bunch of shit and things like that. So when it comes to updating technology, I'm getting there slowly but surely. Hopefully I'll be able to catch up with um, the rest of my family with the new phones eventually. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, share, subscribe, all that jazz. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.